everybody, it's Jenny from Norman S. Wright. Last week I said I want to do a couple topics on controls, so let's continue with that theme. This week let's talk about what is dead band. Let's get started. The dead band is basically a temperature range in which the thermostat won't send a signal to the system. Let's look at why we would want a dead band. Let's say that you have an HVAC system that has heating and cooling changeover and your thermostat set point is 75 degrees. If your space is 76 degrees, the thermostat will call for cooling to get the space back to 75 degrees. So the cooling goes on and it starts cooling the space. So let's say the system gets cool and the space is now 74 degrees. Since the set point is 75 degrees, now the thermostat will call for heat. And then when it gets to 76 degrees, it's going to call for cooling again, back down to 74, call for heating, and it will go back and forth like this. You really don't want your system working like this. You don't want it switching between heating and cooling all day. Let's move this over. Now let's look at what would happen if you had a dead band. Now your thermostat cooling set point is 75 degrees but we also have a heating set point of 68 degrees. This seven degree band is the dead band. If your space is 76 degrees, the thermostat will call for cooling to get the space back down to 75 degrees. So the cooling goes on and it starts cooling the space. Let's say the system cools the space and now it's 74 degrees. Nothing would happen now, your set point is satisfied. Even down to 69 degrees, nothing would happen because you're still above the heating set point. Nothing will happen until you get below 68 degree heating set point. So at 67 degrees, the thermostat will send a signal for heating to drive the temperature back up. And then as your temperature increases, you end up between the heating and cooling set point in the dead band area and nothing happens in here. Now let's move this over one more time. The tighter the dead band, the better it is for comfort. Like personally, I would not be comfortable if I had to wait till it got below 68 degrees to kick the heat on, but other people would be comfortable in there. In our last example, if the dead band was only three degrees, if your cooling set point was 75, then your heating set point would be 72 degrees, and the heat would turn on in the space once you got below 72 degrees. Most digital thermostats have adjustable dead bands, and they're usually set between three and six degrees. The optimal dead band depends on the application and how sensitive the application or the occupants are to having nothing happen while you're in dead band. Wider dead bands save energy, but they might be sacrificing comfort, so like many things, there's often a trade-off between the two. Let's bring it all back on screen again. So that's dead band. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our YouTube channel, and thanks for watching.